Do this in memory of me. The mystery of
encouraging and I'm charging the congregation to leave with the same generosity and kindness. First, be kind to yourselves. Lata uno, high blood pressure, overweight. When was the last time someone got the doctor? Start there. You know, you can have a drink too with beer, can drink one in a glass of water. Make sure when you're going to the doctor, the younger ones, yearly, the one, the one, the, the one like me, I get up in the age, but then you've got these twice a year. Make sure when you meet to the benchmark, the colonoscopies, the EKGs. So start with kindness by your, with yourself. You have to be kind to yourself. The one thing my dad did, he enjoyed life. He didn't care what we had to say, what her opinion was. He did what, what was good for George. And then everything else fell later. And my second point is to be kind to each other. You don't have to be in each other's company constantly, but it's okay to say hello when you see each other. If you feel that, you can also put the phone up and call somebody just to say hello. Kindness doesn't cost anything. What you sow is what you reap. And I am here to tell, I stand in this truth. I am a, my blessings are from the kindness of both my parents. I am very blessed and my children are truly blessed. All because of kindness. So I am My final reading will be the obituary. Cleveland George Bryan, 84, passed away on May 26, 2022 at UMass Medical Center. He was born in Jamaica on June 18, 1937, a son of the late Ezekiel and Ivy Bryan. After immigrating to the United States, he settled in Worcester and worked for a Norton company for many years until he retired. He was a longtime owner and operator of the former Maytag laundromat and also owned multiple rental properties in the city. Cleveland loved saltwater fishing, playing cards and dominoes with family and friends, and watching sports. He also made sure he was dressed sharp and enjoyed shopping for himself and his family, always bringing, buying them the very best. Uncle George enjoyed hanging out, socializing with friends at Sunni's Pub over a rum and a coke. Mr. Bryan was a devout Catholic and a longtime parishioner of the Cathedral of St. Paul. He leaves behind his wife, Rosalie P. Bryan, his children, Angela, Angela Bryan Gamble, Sandra Bryan Thomas, Carlita Bryan Spike, his stepchildren, Henry Davison, Joan Beckford, Joseph Davison, Myrna Davison, and Trisha Sergeant. His siblings, Alonzo Ransford and Bobby Bryan, and Dorothy Whitley, Whiteley. Nine grandchildren and 15 great-grandchildren, several nieces, nephews, extended family, and friends. Dad, rest in peace until we meet again. Thank you.
Yeah. Yeah. Who said that? Who said that? in the peace of Christ. May the Lord now welcome him to the table of God's children in heaven with faith and hope in eternal life. Let us assist him with our prayers. Let us pray to the Lord also for ourselves. May we who mourn be reunited one day with our brother. Together we meet Jesus Christ when he who is our life appears in His glory. I would like to invite all of you right now to say some prayers of thanksgiving quietly for His life and for the legacy He bestowed on all of you during His lifetime. We read in the sacred script, Longing for the coming of God's kingdom, let us pray together once again the prayer our Lord Jesus taught us. Our, our Father, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. The power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. God of holiness and power, accept our prayers on behalf of your servant George. Do not count his deeds against him, for in his heart he desired to do your will, and his faith united him to your people on earth. So may your mercy join him to the angels in heaven. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Eternal rest grant unto him, O Lord, let and let perpetual, perpetual light, light shine, shine upon him. him. May he rest in peace. Amen. 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 May his soul and the souls of the, all the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen.